right, 13 love, 13 wisdom, 13 knowledge, 13 respect. So this video right here is to show y'all how to connect with nature, particularly how to connect with this tree. Uh, this is structures that have been given to me. You may have your own structure, your own way of doing things. But I'm, I'm a nature man, you see what I'm saying? So 13 to nature. So before we approach a tree, a lot of people do it different, like I said. Uh, we tend to forget to ask this simple question. Tree, do I have your permission to come touch you, to be around you? When you listen, you be quiet, and you, you feel the air around you. I already got the clear, the clearing, I can go ahead and do this. So as you approach this tree, you know, he's gonna approach it quietly. And you may ask a question, put your hands on it, um, Ground yourself if it's if it's weather permitting. Uh, put your back up against the tree. Uh, be quiet. Allow for the tree to communicate, and you will start to feel sensations through the body, tingling, things of that nature. That's what I connected start to before. Now here's another little technique I learned. Uh, just looking at a documentary, you put your stomach your your light your sacral your stomach on the tree and this forms a life force connection a deeper life force a life force connection and you'll start to feel stuff opening up in here or you might feel a pull I haven't quite gotten to the part of using this technique, but I do feel a little difference right now, like a little pull or opening right here. But everybody's chemistry, their way of doing it and thinking is a little more different. Um, you can also draw a life force energy from this tree by asking permission. I mean, you don't have to, but the honorable thing is to ask. And you'll get much better results. Um, you could draw it from just like this. Without touching it, you could touch it. Draw it from the feet. You could actually draw a life force energy for the ground as well. Um, the tree will start to talk to you. Nature will start to talk to you. And, um, you know, you, you got to be quiet, listen, meditate, deep breaths as well. And... Um, like I said, if you need some healing, ask this tree, can you heal me? You'll get a response and you'll start to feel a difference in your body, depending on how sensitive you are, maybe right away, or it may be a couple days later, the pain be gone. But uh, I think that's all that I can say about this. Uh, also, if I have some water with me, I like to pour libation. If I have some fruit with me, give it an offering. Ancestors are in the trees. So just imagine this tree this tree is communicating to all these other trees around it. But then also, this tree can be communicated all the way over here to a tree in Africa. So these, these trees are antennas of the earth. They're telephone lines, and they send each other messages of what's going on on the planet. So that's why it's so important to get grounded, touch a tree today so you can get your message. Uh, for more information on what I, uh, I do at Walker Minds, uh, visit walker-minds.com. If there's information on there for you uh, while working on it to get it out there. So, 13 love, 13 wisdom, 13 dollars, 13 respect, 13 balance to all. Now hug your trees, plant your trees, plant your feet, get back with nature. 13 peace.